welcome to our 45 minute total body boot camp. I'm Rebecca Gahan with Kick at 55 Fitness. Today you need a medium pair of dumbbells and a lighter pair of dumbbells. Remember, subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on that bell so you receive all of our notifications. All right, we've got a great big waterfall today. We're gonna get started. This is circuit one, exercise one, mountain climbers. So we're gonna add on, add on, drop off, drop off. It's gonna be a blast. 10 seconds. Driving those knees to your chin. All right, we're going for five push-ups. One, two, three, four, five. Standing up, cross body punches, get low, cross, cross. We're squatting down, we're punching. So this is still circuit one. We've done exercises one, two, and three. Okay, getting back down, circuit two. Mountain climbers again. push-ups, 10 total. Standing up, cross-body punches. Lunge back and kick, 10 per leg, one. And switch legs, 10 on the other side. Okay, we're starting again, circuit three. Exercises one, two, three, four, and five. Standing up, cross body punches. And reverse lunge and kick, eight per side. on the other side. And we're gonna pick up a dumbbell. Steering wheel, 30 seconds. We're gonna extend a dumbbell out and steer it. This is the end of circuit three. Each other. 
Okay, starting now, circuit four. We skip number one, we just go to number two. 20 push-ups. Nice job. Cross body punches. This is circuit four, by the way. A little faster. And nice job. Six reverse lunges with a kick per leg. Six on the other side. And steering wheel, 30 seconds. Nice job. Pick up a second dumbbell. We have side to side lunges with alternating upright rows. So we're gonna have our legs spread apart. We're gonna laterally lunge, sticking our feet in one place to the left. Come up, right upright row. Now to the right, left upright row. Keep it going. A little bit faster. Let me get a little more fluid. Done. Okay, time for circuit five. With circuit five, we start with exercise four. We have four reverse lunge and kicks per leg. Exercise four, four reverse lunge and kicks per leg. Nice job. Now it's time for the steering wheel. 30 seconds. Just to find somewhere that finally feels like home. Oh, oh, oh. I hate all this overthinking. Oh, 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 oh. I'm more I swim, no more. This is circuit five. And side to side lunges with that alternating upright row. Nice job. Okay, exercise 
seven, horizontal chest press, five total. So we're gonna take the dumbbells out from our chest, contract that core, five total. One, two, three, four, and five. We are done with circuit five. Get some water, it's time. Okay, we're gonna resume with circuit six. Circuit six. With circuit six, we start with exercise five, steering wheels. Steering wheels, 30 seconds. Side to side lunges with that alternating upright row. Okay, 10 horizontal chest press, 10 total. <laughs> 10, and now we have 30 seconds of a squat with a press up. 30 seconds, let's go. Done. Okay. Whew. Circuit. Whew. Circuit six is complete. We're moving on to circuit seven. Circuit seven, we start with exercise six. Side to side lunges, alternating upright row. Here we go. And 15 horizontal chest press. 15 horizontal chest press. Okay. Whew. Okay, 30 seconds of squat with a press up. 30 seconds. And adding in exercise nine, we have whew, three forward and reverse, reverse lunges per side. So holding the dumbbells, suitcase position. We're gonna forward lunge, reverse lunge. That's one, two, three, three on the other side. Circuit seven is complete. Get some water. 
We'll be moving on shortly to circuit eight. So for circuit eight, we start with those horizontal chest press. 20 total, 20 total. And this is also why I have the lower weights if you need to drop down even halfway through this set. We've got this. Circuit eight, let's go. 20 horizontal chest press. Way to go. 30 seconds of a squat with a press up. 30 seconds. Nice job. Okay, forward and reverse lunge. Now we increase the number four per side. Four per side. One. One. That was four, I'm switching to the other side. job. Okay, this is where we're going to need the lighter weights. We have dead bugs, but we're using our dumbbells with the dead bugs. So this is a deep core, lower core exercise. We're going to take our legs, bring our knees up tabletop position. So this is a tabletop. It's like a table. We're going to extend our arms overhead, really bring that core in tight, back firmly plant into the ground. Extend our left leg and our right arm to our ear. And then alternate. So really focusing on having opposite arm and opposite leg extending. Contracting that core the entire time. Do not release it. We're coming to the end of circuit eight. In five, four, three, two, and one. Nice job. If you need some water, grab it. We're gonna be moving on to circuit nine. Circuit nine. Circuit nine starts with the squat press up. Exercise eight, squat press up. 30 seconds, let's go. Untold stories they were left behind. Silent breeze, I got nothing on my mind. This matters, is it safe? Why are you still living vain? Okay, we're increasing the numbers of that forward and reverse lunge, five per side, five per side. Five on the other side.
Nice job. Okay, We're going to dead bugs. Getting those lighter weights. Opposite arm, opposite leg extending. And done. Next up, stationary lunges with a single arm military press up. 10 per side, 10 per side. So I'm gonna have my right leg back, right arm's extending up. This is exercise 11. And switch sides when you're ready, 10 per side. Nice job. Okay, circuit nine is complete. We're moving on to circuit 10. Circuit 10. Starting with forward and reverse lunges. So we started with three. We're gonna end with six per side. Six per side. Let's go. Switching legs, six on the other side. Nice job. Dead bugs, you know what to do. And we are done with those dead bugs. Stationary lunges with the military press up. 12 per side this time, 12 per side. sides, 12 on the other.
Nice job. Okay, we're adding in exercise 12. So renegade rows, but we're gonna extend one leg. So my left leg's gonna be extended. My right knee is stabilizing on the ground. So it's a single arm plank, one leg extended. We're gonna do 10 on each side. One, two, three. Stabilize that core. You can also do this on a bench. Okay, switch. Now my right leg is extended, my left arm is rowing. 10. And this is the end of circuit 10. We're moving on to circuit 11, which starts with dead bugs. So this is our last time for dead bugs. Here we go. And we are done with dead bugs. Stationary lunges, 14 per side with those military press ups. 14 per side with the military press ups. Switching sides. Fourteen. Renegade rows with one leg extended in the air, one knee bent. So my left leg is extended. My hips are parallel with the floor. We're doing 12 per side. Core is tight. Other side. Nice job. And then we're adding on bicep curl 21s, exercise 13. So we have seven bicep curls low to mid. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now seven mid to high. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, all the way down, all the way up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Nice job. That was circuit 11. We're moving on to circuit 12. Circuit 12 starts with those stationary lunges. This is our last set, 16 per side. 16 with those military press ups. Here we go.
16. 16 on the other side. Nice job. Time for those renegade rows. Left leg extended, right arm, 14 renegade rows. Make sure that that leg that's extended is up high enough. Fourteen. Switching sides. Untold stories they were left behind. Nice job. Okay, bicep curls. Seven, low to mid. Seven, mid to high. And seven, all the way down, all the way up. And getting down, cross mountain climbers. We're gonna count these. We have 60 cross mountain climbers. That's right. Six, zero. Let's go. Moving on to circuit 13. Circuit 13. Circuit 13 starts with those renegade rows. We have 16 per side. 16 per side. Here we go. Switching legs, switching arms. Sixteen. Adding on those bicep curl twenty ones, seven in each position. Seven mid to high. And seven all the way down, all the way up. Adding on those cross mountain climbers. 20 more, 80 total. Let's go.
Ready. Nice. Job. Okay, we're gonna grab a single dumbbell or you can grab two dumbbells. We're gonna do goblet squats, but nice and slow and getting low. So we're gonna dip down, letting our hips really sink below our knees, squeezing our glutes, coming up. Get low. No need to count. Just going down and up. We're timing this. No matter how much that I scream, nobody hears. But I see the light from far away. Get nice and low. It's not about the rep count. It's about squeezing your glutes. Thinking about your hip abductors. This is coming to the end of circuit 13. Okay, time for circuit 14. Bicep curl 21s. Last time for these. Seven low to mid. Seven mid to high. And seven all the way down, all the way up. Cross mountain climbers, add 20. So we have 100 of these. 100, this really works your core as much as it works your heart rate. One hundred. Okay, get those dumbbells. Goblet squats, feet turned out, more like 10 and two o'clock, getting nice and low. Nice and low. Thinking about your hips sinking below your knees. seconds, then we're adding on the final exercise of the day, 16, alternating forward lunges with a hammer curl. Here we go. Picking up your second dumbbell, 10 forward lunges with a hammer curl. So we forward lunge, hammer curl. Bring it back. Every little now and then it creeps on back to shape my smile. Nice job. Whew. Okay, we're moving on. To circuit 15, circuit 15. 120 cross mountain climbers. Then we go right into those goblet squats. So this is circuit 15. Twenty. 
20. Oh, goblet squats. Feet are turned out. Here we go, nice and low. seconds then we have 12 alternating forward lunges with that hammer curl okay 12 alternating forward lunges with the hammer curl to go. Okay, we're at the final circuit of the day. Circuit 16. We're starting with those goblet squats nice and low. Let's go. Done. 14 alternating forward lunges with a hammer curl. 14. Get down for exercise one, regular mountain climbers. 30 seconds, let's go. Second, sorry. Okay, we're going now for the final exercise of the day. 16 alternating forward lunges with a hammer curl, and then class is over. 16. Halfway, eight to go. You did it. Stop right there. What do you think you're doing? Stay tuned for our next video and click right here to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Follow us on 
Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok.